A Coons City Councilman is out on bond this evening after turning himself in to Hardin County deputies on a felony theft charge. 56-year-old Ira Braniff is accused of keeping more than $3,000 from the sale of a cemetery headstone, and the headstone was reportedly never received. KFDM's Leslie Rangel has more on what the community is saying about their councilman and leader. This is a mugshot from the Hardin County Sheriff's Office of 56-year-old Coombs City Councilman Ira Braniff. They don't show no kind of leadership. No, none whatsoever. Braniff confessed to felony theft according to a probable cause affidavit. According to the document, he said he kept more than $3,000 he was paid for a headstone to honor Coombs High School student Karen Edwards who died in January. Edwards' mother says she never received the headstone. Edwards' friends say they've had enough. His family, they're already going through enough rough times right now as it is. And that's pretty stupid. Harding County officials tell KFDM News Braniff came here to the Harding County Jail around 8 o'clock this morning, turned himself in, and was able to post his $10,000 bond. He lost his child, and then this come back on him. Ain't no good. During our interview, we learned this man is actually a family member of Edwards. He says their family is distraught. Uh, they're real upset about it, you know, because they can't believe it happened, but it did. And then they, they're really not talking too much about it. This ridiculous messing with someone who's passed on. They should rest in peace and not have to worry about all this stuff. No court date for Braniff has been set yet. In Coontz, Leslie Rangel, KFDM 6 News. People at Mama Jack's Cafe in town had a different opinion. They wouldn't go on camera, but say Braniff was a friend yesterday and is a friend today, and they call him a good man.